Well, hello there, ladies and gents. I'm Tammy Sipniewski. Thank you so much for popping by my channel. And by the title of the video, I'm sure you know what's about to happen. You see this? It's all just a little too much. From the acoustic panels to all the clutter that I have on the table, I want to just purge. It's a new year, it's 2020, and I want to change the look. One of the big things that I want to get rid of is the fairy lights and the shelves. Now, I built those shelves to put on little mementos and little signs and stuff, but it's just, with the way I have my camera set up, it doesn't make sense. The leading lines are off, so they need to go. The fairy lights need to go. They're more 2018, and plus I never really liked the way that they looked on camera. They blink on camera. So I got a few little accessories. I'm going to declutter a little bit, and we're gonna see how it all turns out. So when I yoked down the acoustic panels from the wall, bad news, there were several little spots that the paint came off with them. And that's not supposed to happen. It's like the 3M stuff, and it's supposed to easily get off the wall and shouldn't damage the wall at all. But unfortunately, I have several spots that I am going to have to uh, paint and maybe spackle and putty a little bit. So... Okay, let's do that. Pawn. Bad boy. You attacked Libby. Bad boy. Libby, are you all right? Pawn, you're so nasty. I can't reach that. And voila, just like that, it's all done. I think what made the biggest difference was removing those acoustic panels. You know, I I liked them when I initially set them up. They were helpful to me. I would say the first couple of videos I had done, I did a few podcasts and that really helped with um, the audio, but now they're not helping. I mean, I think they help a little bit when I set up and do the overhead camera for the LumaFusion tutorials. I don't know how they're gonna sound now, but that's okay. I also got this cool little light, this little ring light. I think it's the coolest thing ever. I got it on Amazon and you can change the colors on it. There's also a bunch of different modes that you can put the light through and it does like all these little cool effects. But honestly, I think that um, I like that blue little light. So I'm gonna go ahead and just put it back onto blue. I think I like that color scheme the best. The only thing that I'm going to put on the walls are going to be the pictures of my family. So this is a picture of my great-grandmother holding my grandmother, and she's there with her friend Mary. This was taken uh, circa 1918. This was right before my grandmother's father died of the Spanish flu and left my great-grandmother a widow of five children at 26 years old. She was an awesome woman, never married again, never had a boyfriend, did everything on her own. And of course, this was a time where there was no welfare or food stamps or anything in the country. You, you, either you did it or you died. And that woman did it. She raised wonderful kids and uh, they don't make them like that anymore, that's for sure. And also a picture of my grandma and my pop-up. I love my grandmother so much. Uh, she was like a second mother to me and uh, best woman ever. What a beautiful, handsome couple they were, right? Did they not look like movie stars or what? My grandmother, she sort of looked like um, Linda Evangelista. She was a model from the 90s. That's what my grandmother looked like. And let, let's go ahead and zoom in on a picture of my great grandma while we're doing it. Let me zoom in here. So my mother always tells me that my great grandmother, I have her eyes. All right, well, I think that's about going to do it here for me. Thank you so much for joining me on this journey of the office revamp. In the comment section below, let me know what you think. Do you like the new office setup or do you think I should have kept it the older way? I know sometimes people don't like change. I get it. I don't always like change too, but I think this looks so much fresher and cleaner and simpler. I think the other setup was a little more 2018, right? I I think it was. So my next video is going to be a LumaFusion tutorial on how to do a dramatic title intro.
Ooh, so dramatic. <laughs> well, thank you so much for joining me, guys, really. In the comment section below, let me know what you think of the new office setup. And until next time, wear your sunblock.